What is up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. How are you all doing today? It is so good to be back. I usually take Mondays off of filming a video because Mondays are my busiest day during the week and I just don't have the time to get a video out. So I, I get videos out six days a week and then I take Mondays off. So today's video is a little different. I have come to that point where I have so many glue books that I just don't know which one to work on in the moment. Like I'm I'm on I'm undecisive. I was like I I want to glue book, I want to plan my glue books, but I don't know which one to work in. So I'm going to make myself a little list. I'm going to make a numbered list of all my glue books and we are going to have the dice decide which glue book I will be working in. So I went through all my glue books. I kind of made a rough a rough sketch of what which ones I have. I've got a total of 11 glue books started right now. So I know I know two dice equals up to 12, but like I will definitely be adding more glue books and if you have more than 12, then you just add another dice. It's as easy as that. So I'm going to make a very nice numbered list of all my glue books. And then if I feel compelled to, I will roll the dice and whatever number that is, that will be the glue book that I will work on. Does that sound awesome? I, I really, really love, love that idea. It's just, I like, I just like the idea of randomness too. I like it just being totally random. Like, if, if I do feel like working on a specific glue book, then I'll work on that one. But if I am like, I don't know which glue book I want to work on for that day, I'll just, I'll just roll the dice. And it will decide for me. And I am totally okay with that idea. I, I kind of actually like that. I'm going to write a few extra numbers here, even though I've only got 11 glue books but I'm sure more will be added to that. So let's see, we have, I have a rainbow glue book. I have my random glue book. Let's see, I have the, oh, the five page challenge glue book. Let's see, challenge. I probably could probably, oh no, I totally spelled that wrong. I just totally spelled it wrong. Don't, don't, don't come for me, guys. Don't come for me. I have my Lisa glue book. There is the mini glue book. I have my Christmas glue book. Let's see. I can't read my own handwriting. What do I have left? What is there? Okay, yeah, wait, I also have the, there's the winter, winter, spring, fall, summer, and one more. What is that last one? Let me see here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, me, random. I feel like I'm missing one. Oh, okay. Alphabet. Because that is the newest one that we added to the list. All right, so that is my list of all my glue books that I've got started right now, guys. And actually, for the five-page challenge one, I'm going to add a little something extra to it. I am, I am. Let me see if I can, if I can get this nice and... Fancy like, oh my gosh, I'm like, come on, come on, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, okay. All right, so with my five page challenge book, I wanted to do something kind of cool and have like six options 
of things I can add to one of my five page challenge spreads that I do. So like this is, this is like what I mean. What I mean is um, if I roll the dice for one through six, just one of them, so I only got six options, I could either get washi tape, stickers, a stamp, one extra page, one random die cut, and then I still need one more uh, idea. So like if I'm doing a five page challenge, I can roll the dice for one extra item and it can be any one of these. I don't know what I'm going to get. So I think that's pretty, that's a really, really cool idea. I really, cause then you can add a little, just a little something extra to your five page challenge. But I've only got five ideas. So let me know in the comments and if you would, what would you like to add to your one page or your five page challenge? Cause I need one more, one more item. So I got washi tape, stickers, a stamp, just with just one stamp, any stamp, one extra page from the same magazine or one random uh, die cut or like a, a punch out. A die cut is like those cute little, little shapes that you uh, cut out of paper. And it's one, and it's random too. So I just got to reach into the bucket and draw out a random piece. Totally random. So there, what do you think guys? What do you think? That's my list. That's my list. <laughs> I'm so excited. I really, really like this. Okay. Should we, um, should we uh, roll the dice and see which glue book we can play with this evening? Just, just a quick little play. Cause I don't want this video to be too long. Let's see what the dice say. 10. We're going to work in the summer glue book. The summer one. Okay. Let me dig that out and I will get some, uh, get some cool things to work with here. Alright. Summer glue book. Come here. Summer glue book and some images. Now the summer glue book isn't 100% finished because I haven't gotten my washi tape to do the edges yet but I can still kind of add some images on the inside it'll be it'll be okay we're just we'll just do that very carefully and only get them like towards the inside and I don't have I don't have to add a bunch guys I don't really have to go go crazy see like an image like that that'd be cute for a summer one what else do we have in here that'd be good for summer Oh, doesn't that look delicious? Oh my gosh, that looks delicious. What could we throw in here that's more summer-y? That's a good one. Doesn't that scream summer? Let's see, what else do I got in here? I got so many amazing images. Just gotta dig through. What I also... What I also would like to do, I'm just, I'm just throwing ideas out there for you guys. What I want to do is I want to get like a separate, like little, um, oh, that's definitely summer. That is definitely summer. Oh, that is so cute. Okay. I got a couple images here. I'm not going to do a whole bunch. All right. Sorry. What was I saying? I, I totally lose track. I lose track. Oh, I'm just uh, throwing some ideas around for you. What I want to do is I want to get like a uh, like a separate little box or container and use that to just throw in a bunch of random pieces and images. Like if I get a single magazine, I might dedicate that one magazine to just toss into the bucket. And then maybe I get a, another random magazine and I'll toss that into the bucket as well. So, so that I have like a nice, nice, nice box of just a collection of random pieces. And I'd like to use that as like for a mystery glue book. So basically you would just stick your hand in and you just draw out an image. You don't know what you're getting. And then you would just stick it down on a page. And that would be kind of like making a mystery glue book. And I really... I like, I like mysteries. I love surprises and mysteries, fun stuff like that. So I really, I really want to try something like that. So let me know what you guys think of that. I do need to get some more, 
magazines though, like a bunch of random magazines. So I might just go to like a thrift store and just maybe grab a handful of some crazy random ones to just throw all together. I think that'll look okay right there. Do you think? What? I'm sorry. I know. I know. I love you too. Can you hear the baby in the background? He He's demanding attention. So uh, I'm going to hurry up and finish this so uh, I can give the baby some love. I'm going to give the baby some love. <laughs> Your nose is cold. Dude, I've got bare legs and he's got a wet, cold nose with whiskers. You can imagine how that goes. Yep, I just need to get, I need to get, order my washi tape for my summer book yet so that I can uh, tape the edges. Just need to get my washi tape. I think I found some washi tape that I like on Amazon. I just haven't ordered it yet. Haven't ordered it yet. Kind of got to pay off the credit card bill first, you know? You know how that goes. Can't have, should I just have this right smack in the middle? I want this right smack in the middle my glue book and I can do that. So, meh. <laughs> no, no. I'm just playing with you guys. I'm just playing with you guys. I am busy running my sprinklers outside right now. It's like, oh, we haven't had rain in a while, so things are drying up fast. It's like it hasn't even been summer yet, and it's like we already have to sprinkle a ton. I'm like, no. And that just, you know, makes the house bills go up. You know, the electric bills and the water bill. And it's like, no, we don't want the bills to go up. All right, cool. A few, a few images added into the summer glue book. That's going to bug me. Oh, well, you know what? It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I'm fine. We're all fine on this glorious day. This glorious glue booking day. He, all right, the summer book is officially started. So what do you think of that, guys? Isn't that a really cool idea? If you're ever, like, don't know what glue book you want to work in, just make a little numbered list, write all your glue book names down, and then just roll a dice. Let it pick for you. It's it's fun. It's, it's random. And I... I really like this idea. I, I do this with a lot of other things, like for all my other crafty things. When I'm, I'm in a crafty mood, but I don't know what to work on. So I just, I roll a random. I have a whole list of all my crafts and I just roll a random. And it's like, it's a lot of fun because you don't know what, and it's like, you don't know what you're going to be working on. And it's like, I would have never thought of that. That's kind of cool. So yeah, it's a, not, a, not a bad idea. I kind of really made this look awful. Maybe I can make it look a little cuter or something. I love these sparkly gel pens. I love these sparkly jelly rolls. I got these actually from the Dollar Tree, believe it or not. These came from the Dollar Tree. Love the sparkle to it. I don't know if you guys can see. Can you see the sparkle? Oh, you can see the sparkle. These are awesome, awesome gel pens. They go on so nice and smooth. And they are super sparkly. Super sparkly. Yep, I am totally getting distracted. Totally getting distracted. Sorry, guys. Sorry, guys. It needs it needs a little something extra over here. It needs to do a little something, something, something. Here we go. Yeah, yep, I am I am totally getting distracted. Absolutely. Absolutely. But we're allowed to do that. But yeah, I need one more um, random item that I can add for my five-page challenge. So if you guys have any ideas of what that could be, let me know. I've already got five. I've got washi, sticker, stamp, one extra page, and one random die cut. So I need one more item that I can stick. So I need six because one dice has six numbers. But yeah, so this is a lot of fun. I'm really going to have a lot of fun in the future if I just want to totally... Roll the dice and pick a random glue book. You can totally do that. And if you want, you can also keep a little journal to write down the date that you glue booked and, you know, which glue book was, was picked. Like, which one did you roll on this day? That'd be kind of fun, too. So you can kind of go back and look. It's like, oh, so I worked on that one quite a bit, and then that one was rolled a lot. and Or, you know, just to go back and see how the dice roll for you. So, yeah. There you go, guys. 
there's a, a new fun idea for your for your glue books. I had a lot of fun with this. I'm definitely gonna be doing this a lot because you know when you got so many glue books, you just you don't know what to pick. You don't know what to go with. But yeah, if you like this video, hit the like button and also leave a comment down below for me. I love reading your comments. It's so much fun. And I will see you in tomorrow's video. Tomorrow's going to be a fun one. I'm so excited for tomorrow. You got to keep watching, guys. Keep on gluing.